hello this video is about uh, transfers of matrix this is required uh, you should know about uh, transfers of matrix because uh, only then you can uh, find out the inverse of matrix okay so what is the transfers of matrix so the basic thing is in this uh, transfer of matrix is that whenever you remove row and make it column it will become transpose suppose uh, a matrix a a is uh, suppose this is just an example 295 and uh, 625 so what is the transpose of transpose of this matrix a so the procedure to make transpose of matrix a is that just remove the row and make it column just remove the first row and make it column so it is denoted by a dash so a dash so this is the row this is the first row make it first column in a dash so what is the first row is that this is the first row 295 so 295 first row becomes the first column and the second row 625 becomes the second column 625 so a dash is the transpose matrix of A. So here you can see what is the transpose of transpose of matrix A dash A. What is this? Means when you remove this row and make it column, it will become similar to A. First row becomes first column, second row becomes second column, third row becomes third column. So you will get the same value A. So transpose of transpose of matrix is same, similar. Okay, for uh, symmetric matrix, A dash, sub, for any symmetric matrix, A um, uh, transpose of matrix is sim same as A dash. Suppose this, here is the example of symmetric matrix. Suppose uh, 1, 2, 2, 6. So you can see this is a symmetric ma matrix. How? the this is the uh, leading diagonal and element is uh, across this diagonal is mirror images so this is a symmetric matrix uh, if we want to this is suppose a and what is a dash to find out the transpose of matrix you just re remove the first row and make it first column so one two becomes first column this is the first second row make it second column two six so what you see here this is similar to a 1 2 2 6 1 2 2 6 so a is equal to a dash for symmetric symmetric matrix here is m symmetric matrix for a uh, skew symmetric matrix is q you will see that uh, for is any skew symmetric matrix a is equal to minus a dash here is the example this is the property how you can say that so first take a example a if a is equal to 0 0 leading diagonal should be 0 and mirror images are negative mirror to the di leading diagonal should be negative to each other if this is minus on this so this is the leading diagonal is 0 and uh, opposite to the um, across the this uh, diagonal is uh, negative to each other so this is a skew symmetric matrix so what is a dash a dash is equal to make first row to the first column so 0 1 make the second row to the second column minus one zero so what do you see if uh, so minus what is uh, minus so a dash is this so minus a dash is you have to multiply each element with minus one so it will become zero one minus one zero so a is equal to minus a dash so any square matrix first of all you see 
this uh, rule is applicable for only square matrix so any square matrix m suppose m is a square matrix can be ex expressed as a sum of symmetric matrix and skew symmetric matrix k and r any matrix any square matrix can be represented as the sum of symmetric matrix and skew symmetric matrix where k is the k is equal to how k is m plus m dash divided by 2 and r is m minus m dash divided by 2 so so any matrix can be represented by sum of symmetric matrix and skew symmetric matrix and what is this matrix is always a symmetric matrix and this matrix m minus m dash divided by 2 is always skew symmetric matrix so we are going we are now going to prove this suppose a matrix m is uh, 2 5 6 4 i want to represent it uh, this matrix m as a sum of a skew symmetric matrix and uh, means i want uh, m is equal to k plus r where k is the symmetric matrix and r is the skew symmetric ma matrix so what is the value of k k is 1 by 2 into m plus m dash so half into what is m 2 6 5 4 and what is m dash m dash means make first row to first column means 2 6 and make second row to second column 5 4 it is equal to 1 by 2 of half into 4 11 4 11 11 8 how I got this 2 plus 2 4 6 plus 5 11 5 plus 6 11 and 4 plus 4 8 this is equal to 2 5.5 5.5 and 4 so what do you see this k is symmetric matrix how oh, this is the diagonal uh, this is the uh, leading diagonal and uh, element across this leading diagonal is mirror images 5.5 and 5.5 same so this is a symmetric matrix so you first got the value of k symmetric matrix now you have to find out the value now you have to find out the value of m how you will get now you need to get the value of r which is half of m minus m minus m dash so how you will get this half into half into m minus m dash means 26 m is 2654 minus m dash m dash means this transfers of matrix m which is equal to this row make it column 26 Two six and five four. So you just uh, subtract this matrix from this. You will get half of zero two minus two zero six minus five one five minus six minus one and it is 0 4 minus 4 0 half of this so this is equal to how much 0 0 0.5 minus 0 0.5 and 0 so what do you see leading diagonal is 0 and uh, element across this leading element is negative to each other so this is skew symmetric matrix so now you can express the matrix m as 
m as m is 2 6 5 4 is equal to sum of sum of square matrix and skew symmetric matrix 2 5.5 5.5 and 4 plus 0 0 0.5 minus 0 0.5 and 0 so you see this is a k and this is r 2 plus 0 2 5.5 plus 0 0.5 6 5 5.5 minus 0 0.5 5 and 4 plus 0 4 so you can see that m is sum of k plus r k is square matrix and r is skew symmetric matrix so you understood what is the transpose of matrix and what is the property of this transpose of matrix and you also understood how to make the transpose of matrix to make the transpose of matrix remember only just remove the row and make it column this is the only rule to make the transpose of matrix suppose m is uh, m is suppose any other uh, matrix suppose p is 3 into 2 type of matrix so p dash will how much p dash will be number of row will be how much number of row is here 3 number of column is 2 so it will be opposite means it will be 2 into 3 type of matrix remember this another property of transverse matrix you should always remember is that a plus b dash is equal to a dash plus b dash this is for any type of matrix and other property is that a dot b dash is always equal to b dot b dash a dash this you have to remember here it is change means uh, b dash first comes then multiply multiplication of a dash remember that when this is b dash dot a dash is not equal to a dash dot b dash so you have to change you have to bring it first means you have to make the alternation of the matrix if a is the first matrix then the result in the result b dash will be the first matrix to multiply